Funding for Public Square provided by the W.K. Kellogg Foundation, working to improve the lives of vulnerable children. This program is part of American Graduate. Let's make it happen. A public media initiative made possible by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. And viewers like you. I was lost traditionally, mentally, everything. He taught me that, you know what, maybe you didn't have your parents, but you had somebody else that would love you and would care for you. I wish I should have listened to my parents. I, I wish I should have, because the thing that I did to try to go the easy way around, it really didn't work. Our society and the system at play is about criminalizing, especially men of color. I'm not getting his story in the history books. I'm not getting his story. I'm not getting his story. I'm getting a mythical set of values and it perpetuates throughout our society and it, it's, it's faulty. What everyone has shared here is, is what men really need, is a space for them to tell their stories, uh, to validate their experiences. I did get a good role model, but what about the guys that didn't get a good role model? So you're already becoming a leader in your community. Welcome to Public Square, where civic dialogue takes center stage. We're really talking about transforming the ways that we have healthy relationships, where we communicate with each other. And the most important part, and I've heard it today, is that we stop and say that we value each other, right? Mm -hmm. That everybody in this circle has value, has knowledge, has skills, has passion, has the ability to create change, not just for themselves, but I want to take it to the next level, our entire society. Young people in New Mexico face many challenges, but that's particularly true for young men of color. Across the country, there's been an increased focus on these young people because they're more likely to grow up in poverty, live in unsafe neighborhoods, and attend schools that lack resources. They're also more likely to be punished in school, drop out, and get caught up in the justice system. This can impact them and our communities for the rest of their lives. Many young men lack positive role models, especially if fathers are absent or not engaged. But these mentors can help them learn how to be good men and to be involved in their communities. So how do we help these young men find these role models and become the next generation of leaders? In this episode, we feature a group of young men of color who normally don't have primetime television exposure. It's a very personal and candid conversation with young men striving to overcome the obstacles they face. Joining them are the organizations dedicated to helping, as well as men who are in the process of becoming role models. Then we focus on solutions as we bring in community leaders working to improve the lives of young men of color. I think that the challenges that face young men of color are, are incalculable. What really got me in prison was having a role model, but at that time of growing up, our role models, we didn't really see the activities that they did to get the things that they got that we liked, that we admired. I feel bad because I admired the wrong people and for the wrong things. I think it's really important for young men to have role models. When I was 13 years old, I started working for this man, and I believe that if I wouldn't have not um, seen this man as a great role model for my life, I think I would not been outside in public. I mean, I've probably been in prison. I probably would not have been a college student. I probably would have even graduated high school. Young men of color here in central New Mexico are literally hungry for role models and mentors that look like themselves. If we don't have role models, then, we're, then there's going to be people in this world who aren't going to have that spark, that start, that, that inspiration to do things like cure diseases or do things like improve the system or become a, a leader, whether it be political or on a community scale.